hello everyone welcome back with another very useful and informative video in this video i'll show you if you are getting this type of notification on your iphone or ipad device whom would like to send you critical alerts so in this video i'll show you how you can easily fix this type of problem on your iphone or ipad device so first of all here you will have to tap or don't allow and after that check that the problem fixed or not so if you are tapping the don't allow and then after that here you will have to force restart your iphone device by tapping on the volume up button then volume down then press the power button until apple logo appears so here you will have to just simply force restart your iphone device then after that check the problem fixed or not so if you're having still this problem then here move to the next solution here you will have to close the step after that here you will have to open control center on your iphone or ipad device and here you can see that his option of don't disturb here tap on this and here you have to turn off the don't disturb mode on your iphone or ipad device and after that check that the problem fixed or not so if you're having still this problem then here move to the next solution again open setting on your iphone or ipad device then here tap on general so after that tap on soft update and here make sure that you are using an updated version of ios if you don't have and updated version of iOS, then you will have to update your iPhone device to the latest version. Then after that, check the problem fixed or not. So if you're having still this problem, then again open setting. Then here scroll down and tap on general. Then again here scroll down and tap on background app refresh. And here you'll have to turn off the background app refresh on your iPhone device. Then after that, here you'll have to close this tab. Then here you'll have to check that the problem fixed or not. So if you're having still this problem then here move to the next solution again open setting on your iphone device then here you'll need to tap on general so here tap on general then scroll down here then here tap on transfer reset iphone then tap on reset then tap on reset all settings after that check that the problem fixed or not so if you're having still this problem then here you'll have to uninstall that app on your iphone device and open app store on your device and reinstall that app on your iphone or ipad device then after that after all these settings hopefully your problem will be fixed and we'll be able to get rid this problem on your iphone or ipad device so that's it from this video hopefully you like this video if you like this video then please subscribe my channel and also press the bell icon so that you can get my all upcoming videos thanks for watching this video